How friendly were you all with the corrections officers? I that might that that kind of shocked me when I first got there. How friendly everybody was, playing cards and um, on first name basis and things like that. Knowing about their kids and their pets and um, you know burying their cats and dogs and making portraits of children and things like that. But but the fact that um, you know apparently and again this this one guard who was in custody who was in court yesterday in Plattsburgh was saying no I, I had no idea that I was bringing in hamburger meat mm -hmm. full of hacksaws you know he's saying he had no idea but at the same time I'm hearing other reporting that there were other guards at this facility who had cabins in the woods where they were ultimately found showing pictures of their summer places so they were fully aware of what was on the outside. Yeah, I mean, what, what he's saying, he he knew that he was bringing in the hamburgers, he's but he didn't he know he was bringing... He had no idea, this corrections officer, right? Yeah, right. He had no idea what? That he was bringing in weapons, ultimately, to help these two guys escape. Well, I suppose that's... You, it has a plausibility. It has a plausibility, I mean, the, that he brought in a big slab of meat and didn't know that it had a shank in it or something. I mean, I oh, guess... You were saying people were bringing in Omaha steaks to you guys? Yeah, yeah. Well, officers were. Officers were. Mm -hmm. What what did you see come and go that you can now talk mostly about? Mostly like you know, mostly cooking utensils, like like frying pans and um, skillets and electric skillets and um, uh, coffee pots, coffee makers and things like that.